should water be piped from the River Shannon to Dublin to ease Dublin's water shortages, of course, with our leaky pipe system, Shane? What do you make of it? Uh, look, uh, there'll be opposition to this and I kind of get depressed about this kind of opposition because we're an absolutely tiny country and I hate when it's presented as you up in, you guys up in Dublin getting everything and taking, uh, taking everything. I, I, I just... I don't accept that argument. I think it's a depressing argument because, look, the reality is uh, Dublin is the economic engine. Whether people like it or not, Dublin is the economic engine of the country. If Dublin fails, the country fails. So if there's a if there's a water crisis in Dublin, that affects all the multinationals who are in the greater Dublin area. That affects the entire country, including people who live outside the greater Dublin area. So I get, I get really depressed. Like... Perhaps there are environmental and ecological issues about taking water from the Shannon. I, I'm certainly open to hearing those arguments. Absolutely. I think we need to be. And I think it's a good thing that this is explored. But if it's presented in the, you know, up in Dublin, you're getting everything. I, that, that's nonsense. You don't and like I've, the par- parochialism I've no, that, that kind of parochialism, I have no time because we are too small a country for that kind of nonsense. Yeah, well, look, Irish Water have said the only viable option to keep the drinking water flowing in Dublin is to take it from the Shannon. And I would go a little bit further than you. I actually think that, you know... You normally do. (laughs) (laughs) I do on occasion. Um, You know, turn off the tap. What if we turned off the tap? We subsidise. Those of us who live in the urban centres, it's not just Dublin, it's also places like Cork, actually subsidise rural Ireland. In rural Ireland, you don't want to hear this, but local property tax is taken from Dublin and is sent to several counties in rural Ireland. Our utilities are all the same price around the country, even though it costs more to deliver the ESB and the broadband and the water and all of those things in rural Ireland. We pay more stamp duty, we pay more property tax, we pay all of those types of things here. And if the tap is going to be turned off from the Shannon, if we were to turn around and say, well, then we'll hang on to that money and we'll, we'll do a desalination plant on the East Coast, uh, it would be devastating for rural Ireland. Should it not be, not, should it not be recognised, not what you know that Dublin actually helps rural. Are you Ireland. not falling into the same trap as the people who are opposing us and them? Yeah, is in, and, and that's. I probably am, but that's I think what I'm we should reacting. be getting away from. I'm reacting to the fact that they're going. Don't be coming here taking our water. Hang on a second. You take an awful lot of money. You're subsidised to live by the good people. If you're a public sector worker in Dublin and you're a public sector worker on the same pay in rural Ireland, you're better off living in rural Ireland. Okay. I prefer that you scratch our backs, we'll scratch Let's your backs. Let's all scratch approach. each other's backs and be nice to each other. Give us the water from the Shannon.